Some superheroes wear suits for the looks, others wear them to cloak their identity. Then there are the heroes like T'Challa whose Black Panther suit is essential to his performance and ability. The suit not only looks sleek, but has a number of features and details that you probably didn't know about. I'm sure I have much to learn. From space travel to Hulk battles, see everything the Black Panther suit can do. How much more are you hiding? But before you get suited up, click subscribe. You'll join our notification squad and be the first to know of new content. Ready, go! Energy Field Boots T'Challa's rise as the Black Panther gives him a number of increased senses, extreme strength, and the agility of a cat. But a little assistance from the suit can go a long way. Only so much CrossFit can be done to help you climb walls and defy gravity. The key to Black Panther's high-flying moves are thanks in part to the Energy Field Boots on the suit. The bottoms of the boots are able to absorb energy and then use it when Black Panther needs to climb walls, jump on cars, and look pretty much like a flying trapeze artist. Each heel is filled with vibranium, the same material found in Captain America's shield. The boots also help the hero land more like a cat, or should we say, panther. Instead of snapping limbs in two or sending pain throughout his body, the strength of the boots gives him the ability to absorb energy as he lands on his feet. The energy absorption saves Black Panther some strength of his own so he can continue on in battles with more energy and stamina. Basically, the boots give him the ability to jump from building to building and perform the skills of Spider-Man without the webbing and radioactive spider Space travel. Now it's probably too early to get all excited for Black Panther 5, T'Challa in space, but the Marvel Comics series of Black Panther have already showcased the potential for the hero to go on adventures outside of Earth's atmosphere. In the pages of Marvel Comics, T'Challa helps develop a Black Panther spacesuit, designed so he can breathe while floating through the gravity-free vastness of outer space. The suit itself looks similar to the classic Black Panther suit, but features an astronaut's space helmet designed as a panther head. The panther head sits wide open and features a glass viewing panel T'Challa can look through while floating through the space. The body of the suit is reinforced with extra vibranium to help withstand the air pressure and various exposures found in space. Rocket boosters attached at the hip help T'Challa maintain control of the suit before he starts spinning out of control like Sandra Bullock did in Gravity. In the comics, Black Panther travels to a distant planet known as Bast. On the planet, a whole new Wakanda colony is situated there and it helps launch the Black Panther into all types of intergalactic storylines we may one day see on the big screen. Manifesting the suit Iron Man had a large suitcase. Superman uses a telephone booth, and many heroes wear their costumes under their regular day-to-day -day outfits. For the Black Panther, things are a little bit easier. Thanks to the advanced technology found in Wakanda, the Black Panther suit is able to manifest itself over T'Challa's body. The suit essentially is invisible, and activates as T'Challa needs it. This is why the King of Wakanda can dress fly as AF and not have a care in the world when it comes to changing into his costume. As seen in Black Panther, advances are constantly being made to the suit design, and the way the costume is able to manifest itself over time only improves. In Captain America Civil War, a separate helmet was needed for the Black Panther, but now the helmet fully forms over Black Panther's head, much like Star-Lord's helmet in Guardians of the Galaxy. The manifested suit includes high-tech mesh for optimal flexibility while offering protection from stabbings, gunshots, and other physical damage. Now, if we could only adapt the concept into everyday life, getting dressed in the morning would be so much easier, and cosplay costumes wouldn't take nearly as much effort. Black Panther's Hulkbuster One of the shining moments in the Avengers Age of Ultron wasn't the battle against Ultron or other characters like the Starlet Witch. It was when the Avengers went against each other and, more specifically, when Iron Man tried to stop the Hulk's uncontrollable rage. The only way he could do this was with the massive Hulkbuster costume. The armored gear Iron Man wore was not just limited to the red and gold hero. In the issues of Marvel Comics, the Black Panther finds himself going up against a new Hulk character known as Amadeus Cho. The 
only way to stop him was by transforming the Black Panther costume into the ultimate Black Panther Hulkbuster costume. Officially known as the Wakanda Hulkbuster costume, the Black Panther's design looks sleeker and larger than Iron Man's counterpart. The whole thing is more than double the size of the Hulk and creates the shape of a fully formed panther, tail included. Naturally, the costume is filled with advanced technology, allowing T'Challa to predict moves, use massive amounts of strength, and cause lots of destruction while attempting to take the Hulk down. It's time to translate the Wakanda Hulkbuster from the comic book pages and onto the big screen. Wait! Which side of the road is it? For bus sake, just drive! Okay, calm down. A female Black Panther. T'Challa and his father are not the only family members to don the Black Panther costume. In the Black Panther movie, we see the rise in power Shuri has, but the comics explored this even further by giving the character her own story arc back in 2009. During a Marvel crossover known as Dark Reign, T'Challa encourages Shuri to take on the Black Panther mantle, and she does. Dressed like a masked cat woman, Shuri played the role of Black Panther for several issues, showcasing her ability as a hero and why she is so vital to the Black Panther franchise. As part of her costume, Shuri adds a first shoulder piece, but the rest of the costume stays relatively untouched when compared with the Black Panther. The whole arc opens up a lot of possibilities for other characters besides T'Challa donning the Black Panther costume. Of course, becoming the Black Panther involves a lot more than just wearing the garb. The person must be the leader of Wakanda, give themselves to the Panther God, and eat a heart-shaped herb from the God. It's easier said than done, but nice to know there are options if Chadwick Boseman ever decides to leave Marvel Studios. <laughs> Antarctic Vibranium one of the coolest parts of dressing like a panther is having all the features. The claws of the Black Panther are not just for vanity, though. As cool and dramatic as it is to see the claws pop out during the battle, they serve a lot more uses than just a basic knife replacement. The claws on Black Panther's fingers are actually made of Antarctic vibranium. This type of vibranium is an alternate form of the material and is often referred to as anti-metal in the comic books. The Antarctic vibranium gives the Black Panther the ability to cut through nearly anything. Captain America's shield the side of vehicles, and human skin, just to name a few. The claws would basically put Home Depot's saw department out of business if they were sold retail. The strength of the claws pairs with T'Challa's arm strength to give him the ultimate form of hand-to-hand -hand combat and attack. Add the ability to launch the claws out at enemies, and your powers will only increase. Who needs guns and lasers when the throwback claw can do the trick? Along with attacks, the claws become a lifesaver when Black Panther needs to climb or cling onto things like the side of a building. Vision Improvements After eating the heart-shaped herb of the panther god, T'Challa has all types of enhanced senses, including his vision. He can see sharper, focus easier, and even spot danger before it even arrives. Even with all of those vision enhancements, the Black Panther suit offers additional vision powers. When equipped with a helmet, the glowing eyes of the suit do a lot more than just invoke fear into his enemies. Light glares are eliminated, like an advanced form of sunglasses. Whether it's the bright sun or street lights, the vision technology makes everything appear as clear as possible. Night vision technology helps Black Panther look into the shadows and discover hidden threats. This vision improvement really helped the Black Panther when he took over for Daredevil by looking over Hell's Kitchen. Technological features in the eyes can help analyze different people, see in infrared, and work as a similar technology to the Iron Man's visuals. Black Panther sees the world in a whole different light thanks to the eye holes in his mask, and his fighting skills have only improved because of it. In the comics and animated features, the eyes often appear yellow to match the color of a real panther. For the film, the eyes are toned with a more white color to give the costume a more realistic and grounded look. <laughs> The Purple Lights Some superhero costume features are clearly used for vanity. Captain America's star, Superman's Kryptonian symbol, and Wonder Woman's knee-high boots. When the Black Panther gets into action, purple lights start glowing on the suit. But they're not just there for an awesome visual effect. 
The purple lights actually represent the kinetic energy formed from the suit when the vibranium powers are being used. The neon purple lights extend around the suit like arteries and help the energy flow throughout it. Further proof of this can be seen when Black Panther makes a big impact. As the hero uses his body to create an impulse attack, you'll see a large purple ring around the point of impact and typically moving outward from Black Panther's body. The purple rings represent the release of energy from the suit and is essential to protecting Black Panther while keeping the powers intact. The purple lights make a great effect in the movie and in comic books, but only add to the frustration of fans looking to accurately dress like him for the next Comic Con. At least kids will enjoy purchasing light up Black Panther toys with the purple glow found on the action figures. Wakabi, I need you to upload a real time thermal satellite image of the control center. Uploading the image now, Your Highness. The Kimoyo Card. The Black Panther's intelligence only improves while wearing the costume. The main reason for this? The Kimoyo card that is installed directly inside the suit. The advanced PDA is far better than any iPhone release and allows Black Panther to access all kinds of information. The Kimoyo card is fused with the suit's technology, giving Black Panther both visual and audio information while he wears the suit. In the Black Panther comic books, the hero uses the Kimoyo card to track villains, find secret hideouts, and gather information like blueprints. The card first debuted in Volume 3 of the Black Panther and has been mentioned numerous times since. Information is downloaded instantly and Black Panther becomes like a walking direct connection to the internet and information well beyond the web's reach. The card itself was developed in Wakanda and then features connections to nearly every satellite floating above the Earth. When Black Panther wants to remain hidden, the Kimoyo card can also jam signal, disable security cameras, and allow the hero to get through areas unnoticed. As real-life technology advances, the size and presence of the Kimoyo card changes as well. Now, it's pretty much nothing more than digital software built directly into the Black Panther suit. The system still doesn't register there having been another person there. Okay, fine. I'll admit it. Whoever this intruder is, he's got some okay technology. Cloaking and Teleporting the Black Panther has speed, strength, and incredibly impressive combat skills. What else does he need? Why not add cloaking and teleporting to the mix? Just when you thought the Black Panther couldn't get more impressive, you find yourself flipping through the pages of the newest comic issue only to discover Black Panther just appeared out of nowhere. The advanced technology in the suit has allowed the hero to jump from spot to spot, although the feature has been limited in use over the years. The technology in the suit allows Black Panther to cloak himself as multiple visual illusions allow him to blend into background. In the comics, Black Panther used the cloaking ability to sneak up on enemies and disarm them of their weapons so no more harm could be done. Obviously, these powers are rarely used because then Black Panther would become a little too powerful for his own good. With no vulnerabilities, a hero becomes too godlike and more boring to watch. Still, the mix of strength and power from the Black Panther has allowed the hero to take on several different villains over the years, including both Doctor Doom and Thanos. He really can take on anyone who challenges the Wakanda king. And there you have it. What suit feature is the most impressive? Is this suit better than Iron Man's? What suit features do you want to see on the big screen? Let us know in the comment section below. And don't forget to like this video, share it, and subscribe to CBR on YouTube so you can stay up to date with our awesome videos. Thanks for watching.